When Lucifer was cast out of heaven, a third of the angels fell with him. The Bible tells us that. We aren't told exactly what type of angels these were. Some scholars suggest they may have included high-ranking ones based on Revelation's account of four powerful angels bound until the tribulation. When released, these angels lead an army of 200 million horsemen, though it's unclear whether this is literal, symbolic, or represents a modern military force. Some commentators believe these four angels are principal fallen angels, drawing from Ephesians 6.12, which describes a hierarchy of evil forces, including principalities and spiritual hosts of wickedness. A passage in Daniel 10.12.13 also supports this idea. It tells of an angel delayed by the spirit prince of Persia, until the archangel Michael intervened, indicating powerful evil beings exist. Thus, the four angels bound at the Euphrates could be high-ranking fallen angels involved in Lucifer's rebellion, and their release will bring devastating consequences, including the death of a third of humanity.